Welcome to this quick video on the, some new commands in Microsoft Teams. So when you're in a chat or a channel, you can use the slash key to bring up some really quick commands and just be super productive and save time doing some of the things that you might do on a daily basis. So let's have a quick look. I'm in the chat right now and I've got my message at the bottom, my, my type of message box. If I click in there and press the slash key, you'll see I've got a number of commands that are open that I can see a different thing. So I can open this chat in a new window. I can open up settings. I can hide the chat, which is quite useful if I want to just get rid of it out of my eye line. I can record a video tip clip. I can set my status to busy, be right back, do not disturb. So you can do all your status quick commands right in here whilst I'm in a chat, which is quite useful if I'm chatting to someone and someone else is bothering me and trying to bring me into a meeting. And you can see I can add components and all sorts of stuff. If I scroll down, you've got a ton of options in chats. So really have a look at these. And if you use something all the time, remember, you can just type it in. You don't even have to scroll down and then it will automatically do that for you. I'm just gonna press return and it will set me to away. So really nice, really simple. You can see in the top left-hand corner there because you can't see my top right corner, I am set now to away. So in chats, you've got loads of options. Slightly different in channels, but if I just nip to a channel and I go to start post, and I click into the message section and again, do the slash, you'll see I've got a few options. There is not as many, but there's definitely still some there. So if I'm in a channel, doing some work, having a conversation or something else, you can see I can still use a number of these quick slash commands in order to, to make some changes, to make myself unavailable, to add applications and loops and all sorts of stuff into chats or into channels. So one, I think to definitely have a go, have a look at, very quickly, you just press that slash key, just like I have done. And then you can see what you can do very quickly without having to move out, use your mouse and navigate around the system. So you're not taking your focus away from the task that you need to do. So one to have a go at, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and let me know what videos you'd like me to record next.